What is up guys and welcome back to the insane inventory! Yeah! Okay guys, so today I'm going to be doing a review on all of the Nickelodeon slide kits. Nickelodeon slash crazy art because they have like a little collaboration. But, oh, I got boogers. But anyways guys, I got all the Nickelodeon slimes that I could find at Walmart, including JoJo's. And uh, we're just going to basically compare all of them. There are two here that I haven't tried of Nickelodeon and I'm very excited for. But anyways, we're just going to be basically saying which kit is the best. If this kit's the best, or if this kit's the best, or if this kit's the worst, or if this kit's the worst. You know what I'm saying? And yeah, today's link my shot is going to be try to put the like button with your pinky. And if you guys didn't know it, make sure you comment down the last week. I did it. And let's get straight on into the video. What Yo. <coughs> chalk slime I think yeah chalkboard slime I have literally never made this before I never even heard of chalkboard slime I don't even know if that will work oh you can paint on it that's why it's not actual chalk anyways okay so here's how it looks guys all right put that there yeah yeah, yeah. yes okay so here are all the contents guys it comes with a bowl some paint then a container it comes with two two ounce containers in this bag and a measuring cup and then some sticks for stirring and a spoon uh, a bottle of clear slime glue, another bottle of clear slime glue, cool, and some slime activator, yes. And then it comes with two more containers, two ounces, and a measuring cup, and basically the stirring stick and the spoon, and then two paint brushes. This is a really cool kit, guys. I'm super excited for this. And then also some paint. This kind of looks like it's chalkboard paint, but I can't tell, but anyways. Okay, so first we're gonna get our three milliliters of clear glue. Okay, so here's our measuring cup, guys. Let me get my clear glue, yeah. Okay, let's pour that in there. Then it says to measure 40, 45 milliliters of water. There's 30 milliliters, boop. And then 15, right? All right, and let's start mixing. Okay, yes. All right, so we got two spoonfuls. So this is chalkboard paint, not just normal. Okay, two spoonfuls, here we go. There's one spoonful, and there's another spoonful. I don't know if you guys can see or not, but I haven't added any activator whatsoever, and it's like like already clumping up, and I don't know why, it's so weird. So it says to put 7.5 milliliters of the activator, but I'm just gonna add it slowly. I don't feel like measuring. Honestly, when it comes to activator, guys, it kind of just depends with everybody. Okay, now I'll start kneading. Another thing I like about the Nickelodeon Slime Kits, guys, is that they have the activator already made. Okay, so there it is, guys. There's my final product. It is a bit sticky. I don't know why, but <laughs> it is not very stretchy. It's very glossy. I love how glossy it is. This should be like a glossy slime kit. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and start trying to paint on it, I guess, because I think that's literally it. Okay, guys, so it says to leave your slime to dry for a little bit. I don't know why, but I'm not gonna do that because I don't feel like it. <laughs> but I think it should be fine, but if it doesn't work very well, um, I'll leave it to dry, but I'm just gonna go ahead and start painting on it already. And let's start painting. <laughs> it's painting on this line, guys. This is actually painting very well. You can literally paint with the other side of it better. And I want him to be mad. <laughs> that looks like a witch, guys. I literally just made a witch. Ta-da! This is pretty cool. I like this, guys. It's really fun. Okay, well, I actually really like this chalkboard slime. Um, I feel like it should, it would have been better if they added like some cornstarch in there just to make it a little bit like more matte-ish and like firm. And also, instead of like clear glue, white glue, I feel like that would have been better. But um, anyways, I like it. I'm gonna give it a nine out of a 10. You guys comment down below if you like it too. And let's try the next one. Next one I'm gonna try, guys, is JoJo Slime Kit. And I know I just did this one, but I only did Giggly, Fluffy, and both Sparkles. So I'm gonna go ahead and do the glitter one. And yeah. Okay, well this one came with different stickers, so that is pretty cool. All right guys, and here are the instructions, everything. Okay, let's start. All right, so the bowl did get a little deformed, but it's okay. This kind of completely cracked, guys. Okay, so I'm gonna guess for this one, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna go off my own rule since I already did it. I don't really wanna put water, because I don't like putting water in this slime, especially clear. So I'm gonna see it without the water. Okay. Okay, and I'm gonna put all of the glitter in there. So I got this purple one. Ooh, that's some pretty glitter. And then this pink glitter. I'm gonna put all of that because otherwise it's just gonna be like thrown away. Now let's mix that. Whoa, that's a lot of sparkles. Okay, well I'm really sad. I can't see any of the pink sparkles, which really sucks. Okay, I'm just gonna add a little bit of the drops. Okay, 
It's almost done, guys. It's very nice and thick. That's what I was hoping for. Okay, so there it is, guys. I like it. What do you guys think? Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and give JoJo's a 10 out of 10. I love it. It's, everything in it is so awesome. It, it also comes with this really cute bow case container, and it has uh, googly eyes, bow sparkles, glitter, this whole thing of paint, a bunch of sticks, and a spoon, and a bunch of stickers, too. And I like it a lot. You guys comment below what you think about it, and let's try the next one. The next one I'm gonna do, guys, is one I haven't tried before. This one is a color changing slime. Let's see. Okay, there's three bowls. So here's all of the stuff that comes with. It comes with three paint jars. I want to guys these are color changing. And then um, a bunch of containers. Uh, there, there's six two ounce containers, a uh, spoon and some popsicle sticks, clear slime glue, and some activator and a bowl and a measuring cup. Let's start. Okay, so let's look at the instructions. Measure 50 milliliters of clear glue. Alrighty. Okay, there we go. Okay, now it says to add 20 milliliters of water. I want to only do 15 because I don't want it to be super jiggly. Okay, so that's like 15 milliliters. And then I guess the paint. Yeah, add one spoonful of the colorant to the bowl. I want to do this red one. Okay, let's grab like that. It says a spoonful, but I think this should be good. It's like around the same thing. Full spoonful. Okay, so let's go ahead and mix that. Ooh, that looks really cool already. Alrighty, now we're gonna go ahead and activate it. Add a few drops of activator. Okay, this one's taking a while to activate, guys, but when I'm going like this, it is already changing color, so a lot of those times when I have, like, color changing, like, temperature changing slimes, it always, like, it takes a lot. Like, you have to literally get actual fire and, like, put it on the slime so it can actually change color, and I really don't like when it, you have to do that, but this one is actually, it's not that much. You have, you don't have to do it a lot. Two hours later. Okay, I think I'm almost done. Ooh, guys, do you see that? Like, it doesn't even need a lot of heat to change color. I don't know if it's just like the slime activator or something guys, but like it's very weird. So I really like the color changing paint in it already. I am finally done guys. That took a very long time, but it's okay. Okay, I don't know if you guys can see or not, but it is turning a little bit more red. Okay guys, here it is. This is its um, hot side, I believe. So it is yellow and I like it a lot. It's like really sensitive. Here's some water. It's pretty room temperature. It's kind of cold though. Ooh, guys, look at that. It's already turning red. It, this one, I really love the paint on this one, guys. Like it doesn't take a lot. Guys, look, it's already red. Okay, so I decided to get a cold water bottle really quick so you guys can see. Yay, it's turning red. Look at that, guys. Do you guys see that? That is just so cool to me. I think my water bottle has to be a little bit colder, but as you can tell, it does change color. I really like this one, guys. I'm gonna give it a 20 out of 10. I really liked it. Like, the paint was, like, spot on. Like, you didn't really have to, you know, have a lot of, like, heat for it to change color, or yeah, you don't have to have a lot of cold, you know, you know what I'm saying? Anyways, so I'm gonna give, definitely give this one a 20 out of 10. In other words, just a 10 out of 10, guys. It's perfect. You guys comment down below what you think about it, and let's get on to the next one. The next one, guys, is this one. I have tried this one. This one is the first one I tried, and I really liked it a lot. So, this one is um, make your own glitter cool scented fun. So this one is a glitter scented slime, I think I'm gonna guess. Okay, well this one's came with letter stickers. I'm gonna guess to name your slime. Okay, so this one comes with two bowls, I believe. So yeah, there's two bowls. And then this packet of containers, which is four containers, and uh, a measuring cup, a spoon, some popsicle sticks, some paint, and then some slime activator, some white glue, and some clear glue, and some glitter, and some glitter. All right, guys, this, this box used to have a bottle of legit scent, and it was so cool, but now they changed it to a container. The paints have the scent in it, I guess, or just one. So I'm gonna guess this is pink one. That's why it's separate. I was, I was wondering why. It smells good though, but I'm a little sad because now you can't like, you know, do your own color and anything, but whatever. All right, so for this one, I am gonna make a pink one. I'm gonna use white glue this time because we haven't used that one and I really wanna use it, so yeah. <laughs> okay, so for the opaque side, you're gonna get 15 milliliters of the glue. Okay, so there's 15 milliliters. There we go. And then you're gonna get 30 milliliters of water. I'm only gonna do 15 because I don't like to make it, you know, so jiggly. Then I'm gonna go ahead and put this paint, the scented one. Seriously guys, look at this paint literally activates it. Look at, isn't that so crazy? I can't really smell it, so I'm gonna put more. Literally guys, look at this, this paint is activating the slime. All right, so now I'm gonna go ahead and add the activator. 
Okay, so here is my slime, guys. My final slime. And it smells like cotton candy. Before, it was a blueberry one, blueberry scent, and it came in a bottle. I was so happy about that, but now it doesn't. I'm really sad. But anyways, this one kind of smells like cotton candy now. Yeah, it really smells like cotton candy. But anyways, I like it a lot. This is so cool. Um, It's not my favorite anymore. It was my favorite, but now it isn't because it doesn't come with the scent anymore. It just comes with paint. But anyways, guys, I'm going to go ahead and give this one a 10 out of 10. I like it. And you guys comment down below what you think about it. Also, guys, you can make a lot more slime. Like, look at, I still have a lot of bottles of glue, and they're literally full. It's just that I was trying to do all the slime kits, so, you know, I only did one of each. So, you guys, comment down below if you like the like a loading slime kits or you think they're overpriced or something. And that is it, guys. We so much, and I really hope I see you next time. Bye!